Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to another video of Isaac, and today I'm going to be telling you, or showing you how you can actually fix your Rust game from crashing on startup, or crashing when you're trying to load into a server. So go ahead and go to your, um, Steam, my bad, I'm about to call it Discord. Go to your Steam, and you want to right click on it and go to properties. Make sure on, actually, this Rust, not Rust staging branch, you might get confused. So you want to go ahead and go to local files, and you want to verify integrity of game files. So once you do that, just press yes, it's going to tell you, it's going to go ahead and verify the files for you. And this should help on the startup, and if it doesn't, I have a couple more messages for you. So let's go ahead and wait till that. Like, it'll t be slow in the beginning, and it'll speed up. <clears throat> but yeah, there's no intro to the video, but let me just shout out my stuff. Um, If you like this video and anything helped you, please consider subscribing or liking and commenting if it didn't help you. And dislike if it didn't as well, because as you know, I'm actually not doing the right thing. But this is what helped me, so hopefully it can help you. Yeah, once you're doing that, you can also do this. So when you want to browse your files, and you're going to right click on this. Make sure this is not the actual one you're supposed to do. You're supposed to right click on it, and you once you get the big menu, you can go ahead and pr click properties, compatibility. And let's look at a couple things. So, as you can see, I have a 640 by 480 screen resolution. This is not the actual resolution you'll be playing in when you actually load up the game. It's when you load in, it's gonna be like that resolution. But once you actually like in the menu, it's not gonna be that resolution. So you can enable that. It just helps the game start up better, and it, um, limits the crashing amount. And then also you wanna do run this program in compa compatibility mode for Windows. Do you want to uncheck this? Press apply and press OK. And if you're still having trouble, I would suggest run compatibility troubleshooter. This would actually help you. And then also, if you're still not doing it, and every time you load Rust, I recommend running as administrator. But let's see if our game files almost verify. Almost. Yeah. That's pretty much all the solutions I can actually give to you. Um, I was trying to look for a video myself, so I just try to. Just did it all by myself. Really, I looked for them, but there's literally none that would help me. And it's like one that's a kid, and he's yelling in the mic. So hopefully this helped one of you, or some of you. If you did enjoy this video, please consider liking and subscribing. It means a lot. And go ahead and join the Discord, just because. Why not? Yeah, go follow my Twitch, too. My name is Isaac. Peace out. Hopefully this helps you. If it didn't, dislike. Peace.